my grandmother used to sing songs. She'd sing about gardens and she'd sing about rain. She'd sing about deer, all kinds of things. And these were such beautiful songs. I could just see them in my mind. And it just stuck in my head that, wow, my grandmother really, really is in touch with the earth and she really took care of it. She was just completely a part of the world. My grandmother helped me to understand that I am part of and I can be involved in the entire cosmological process. The Colorado Plateau is 130,000 square miles. What's an issue these days is that the Colorado Plateau is under tremendous stress because of energy development. Many tribal communities are being persuaded to develop the earth in ways that are unsustainable. Coal mines, power plants, uranium development, there's a lot of unchecked growth. Our work is to try to deal with that and fix that. Well, the Colorado Plateau is made up of many, many different tribal groups. We may have brown skin and, and black hair. Well, mine is turning white a little bit. But we have very different ways of doing things. Otherwise, we'd be one tribe. And so this is a challenge for us working on the Colorado Plateau. Conservationists or environmentalists often would come up with an agenda. And it's sometimes a very valid one, an important one. But this has been sort of a one-way street. To be an effective force on the Colorado Plateau, it's important to engage with tribal communities and to do so in a way that respects political sovereignty and cultural sovereignty. It's saying that Native people can decide on their own what is important. We brought together 11 different tribal communities and convened a series of gatherings. And through the series of gatherings, four priority areas emerged. Protecting water, protecting sacred places, maintaining languages, and maintaining community health. We have a new generation of young environmental workers. I haven't seen this kind of motivation and inspired group of young people since the 60s and early 70s. So I'm, I'm really hopeful.